Hey Wes, here is what we thought about regarding the feature. Following here, we need an automated solution that generates Twitter posts whenever a new blog post is published on our HubSpot blog. The tool should extract key content from the blog post and create a series of Twitter posts that are scheduled to be published over several days. The two key features when a new blog post is published on HubSpot, the tool should automatically generate a series of Twitter posts based on the blog content. And second, the tool should be able to schedule them over multiple days for better content distribution. The exact same feature for published Shopify blog posts would be nice as well. And best regards. So yes, we can do this. It's super easy. Let me show you how. First, you're going to head on over to youraiagent.com. Your AI Agent is a comprehensive business suite of AI agents. I'm building out dozens and dozens of AI agents for your company live on this channel. Enter your name and email address, password, and then click sign up. It's going to drop you onto the settings page. And based on the email feature request, we're going to need to connect either our HubSpot blog or our Shopify store. If you want to see this blog post to tweet agent for other websites, I can definitely integrate that in. Just please write in the comments below which connection you're using and I'll get right at it. But in this video, we're going to connect HubSpot. So let's click on this tab. First, we need to name our HubSpot integration. I'm going to call it my HubSpot blog. And next, we need an access token and a blog ID. For that, we're going to go to our HubSpot dashboard. And to get the blog ID, first go to settings in the top header bar. I'm going to scroll down on this left side and under content, I'm going to click blog. You can change the current view, which blog you want to select. But when you're on the blog you want, you're going to grab this ID from the URL. So it's right after blogs. And in my URL, it's before default. So let's copy this ID and paste it into this input box. There we go. Now we need our access token for that on the same settings page. We're looking for integrations and then private apps. You're going to click create a private app under scopes. You're going to add a new scope. The scope we need is under other. It's called content. So enable this and then update. Then click create app. It's going to show you an access token now. So click show token, copy this token and then paste it in here. Okay, with those settings, now we can click connect. And if everything is good, you're gonna get a notification. It says your HubSpot blog is connected. So we can click okay. And if I scroll down on the connections page, I see that newest connection right here. So normally that's it for the connections and we can go on and start our AI agent. But this one's a bit more unique. We are getting content automatically from your HubSpot blog. And then we're creating tweets with it and then posting it on your Twitter profile, which means we also need to connect our Twitter account. So I'm going to go to Twitter version two. That's the newest one that allows us to post. And for this, we have some setup instructions as well. First, I'm going to name my integration. I'm going to call it at Hey West Frank. And now we need our client ID. So for that, I'm going to go to the developer portal under projects and apps. I'm going to create a project. And then down at the bottom, there's a button that says add app. You can name it what you want. I'm going to call it your AI agent, bunch of numbers. I think it has to be unique. Click next. Now we're going to go to the app settings and then down here, user authentication settings, click setup. We need to click read and write and direct message. The type of app is a native app. And for the callback URI, let's go back to the settings page and we're going to copy this URL. It's this settings page right here. Let's go back, paste it in. I'll also paste it under website URL and then click save. That's going to now open up a client ID. So let's copy that ID and paste it in like so. Now I can click connect. It takes me to a Twitter OAuth page. And what you see in the middle here is the Twitter profile that you're going to connect to your AI agent. So which Twitter profile do you want making the tweets? This is my profile right here, so it's perfect. If you don't see the profile you want, log out of Twitter, maybe clear your cookies and your cache, 
then click the connect button again and then log into the correct account. Then click authorize app. And if everything is good here, you're gonna get a notification. This time it says your X or Twitter version two account has been connected. So I can click okay. And then now scrolling down, I see my two connections right here. All right, now we can go to the homepage. So the homepage of your AI agent shows all of the agents, also known as automations, that are available for your businesses. We have almost 30 available right now, with more being added each week. If you don't see an automation or AI agent that you need, please come up here in the header bar and either click feedback, this will take you right to the form, or just click on support and send me a message. I can usually build the automations that you or your clients need pretty quickly. On the left bar, I'm going to click Twitter version two, and it shows me all the AI agents that we have available for Twitter. The one we're looking for is the new website to tweet. It automatically transforms your latest HubSpot or Shopify articles into engaging Twitter content. So I'm gonna click start now. At the top here, you need to select which HubSpot or Shopify store you want to turn into tweets on which Twitter profile. So this agent is unique. It has two connections. So here we see my HubSpot blog and then my Twitter profile. One important thing to know is once a new article is published, this AI agent triggers instantly. It extracts the key insights from the text, combining them with your preferred posting style, and then crafts a series of unique attention-grabbing tweets scheduled to be posted at consistent intervals of your choosing. Okay, for that first step, we need a content scheduling. So how often do we want this agent to tweet? If a new article appears in our feed, and after we scrape it and create a certain number of tweets from it, how do you want them dripped over a timeline? I recommend a posting interval of once every six to 12 hours. So let's drop this down to six. When do you want this agent to start? And your posting days. Do you not wanna post on the weekends? Maybe not on a Monday. I wanna post on all days of the week. So I'm gonna check all of these boxes. The next part is the agent prompt. So this is clear guidance on how the AI should transform the extracted content into engaging viral and unique Twitter posts. The dynamic data that we're including is the article's text. You get a max of 5,000 characters and a max of 10 posts per article. You can change this agent prompt to whatever you want, whatever style you want, your brand's voice, your tone, how short or long the tweets would be, if they're witty, sarcastic, or professional. You can even provide multiple examples here. By default, I write transform the provided article content into the chosen number of unique, engaging tweets. Each tweet should be concise, attention-grabbing, and crafted to maximize engagement and shareability. Ensure that no two tweets are repetitive while maintaining relevance to the original article and aligning with the desired posting style and tone. Do not use emojis. And then we need to choose how many tweets per article. Let's bump that up to eight. Okay, now I can click start agent and it takes me to the workflows page where I can see all of my active and running agents. I can also see all of my past completed ones as well. This is a test account, so I'm only running one agent at a time. I can click on the info button and I can immediately see that this agent has extracted the content of the last blog post on my HubSpot blog. It actually appears to have seen two new blog posts and it turned those blog posts into 15 tweets remaining in the queue. Here you can change any of your settings. You can change your HubSpot blog or Shopify store or you can change your Twitter profile. You can update your content scheduling edit your agent prompt, change the number of tweets per article, and you can do this all while the agent is running. At any point, you can see all the output history by clicking this button, or you can see your latest tweet, which is written up here, and you have a link to it by clicking this button. It takes me to Twitter where I see this post, and it says horror short stories captivate with an unforgettable blend of suspense, fear, and masterful storytelling. What's your favorite chilling narrative? And if I go over to my HubSpot blog, I see this blog post right here. It says whispers in the dark, a spine chilling horror short story that will haunt your dreams. And it appears that the agent got all of its tweets from this article right here. If you want to try the automatic website to tweet agent for yourself, 
I'll leave a link to youraiagent.com in the description below. If you are new to developing and want to maybe build your own AI agents and turn it into a profitable web app, check out my online course, How to Build a Custom AI App. I'll drop a link to this in the description as well. And if you like this video, I put two more on the screen right now. Both have been catered to your personal YouTube watch history. Give one of them a click for me, give it a watch, and I'll see you in there. Later.